All right, so now let's talk about all the guys that are throwing bikes up into the back of their pickups. A couple of big things that are happening is when you put your bike up there, there's no way to really secure that tire. So the three and a half really comes into play when you're, when you're loading bikes in the back of your truck because you're able to roll the bike right in, cinch the handlebars down, and never worry about your tire turning, and you don't have to jack your shocks all the way down hoping that that tire stays straight. So let's take a look at loading a bike onto a truck. First thing I'm going to do is take the easy chalk, set it in place, and again, you can see all the rails that are running down this particular truck, so I'm just going to kind of set it right in the middle there, right up against the head of the bed. Now, the nice part is the bars actually hit the front of the bed instead of the tire being rammed up against the front of the bed. Now, no rear straps are needed from the tabs when you're putting it into the back of a pickup. I've already got my straps set, and I'm ready to roll the bike up into the back of the truck. Okay, once we get the bike rolled up into the truck, it's as simple as rolling it forward into the chalk. You can see that it rolled into the chalk and there's not a whole lot of pressure on the, on the header of the bed. Now we can take our straps, wrap one in here. Again, these have the softies built right into these, these particular straps, so it makes it real nice. Leave a little slack in there so the bike will lean to the right. Again, we're always trying to do this by ourselves, but remember the easy chalk is not a stand. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this other softy. Once we get this prepared, we're gonna be able to pull, snug those shocks down but you're gonna see we're not gonna to have to pull them as tight as you normally would, worrying about your tire going anywhere. I'm gonna go ahead and give this a little bit of a tug. Walk around to the other side. Let's go ahead and snug up the other side, and we're ready to go. Ready to go. Two straps are done. We're not all the way jacked down on the shocks. You can see there's plenty of room left here so that we're not really putting a lot of stress on the shocks. Again, the chalk is right up against the header of the bed. Just a little bit of pressure here on the front of the header so that you're not gonna bend the header and we're ready to go. Okay, for all you dirt bikers that are, that are hauling two and three bikes, the big challenge when you go to, to haul three bikes is you're always taking that third bike and sticking it around backwards, right? And trying to hike it up into the truck with three or four guys, no more. You can use your ramp, roll the bike right into one of the easy chocks. All you want to do on this one is set it about you know, six to eight to 12 inches back as long as your back tire is going to sit on the, on the uh, tailgate there. Throw a tie-down strap onto the, onto the tab, cinch it tight, run another one to the other corner, roll your bike in, and you're ready to go with three bikes. All right, so now that we covered how to, how to load into the trailer, we got an open bed trailer. Again, that, that goes right along with a toy hauler as well. And no, no having to drill holes or drop your tanks and all the hassle that goes along with loading up a toy hauler or a trailer to take a fun trip. So you don't have to stress out about that anymore. Again, we got the three and a half for the dirt bikes. We got the five and a half inch one right now for the sport bikes and a lot of the V-twins. Stay tuned for the six and a half that's coming out that's gonna handle those 150s and higher and also one for the quads and the rhinos. Again, the easy chocks, out of the box and ready to go. No hardware required. So, real simple. No drilling, no hardware, no mounting. Set the easy chalk in place, connect the back strap for the emergency in case you have to really hit the brakes, and strap the bike into the easy chalk. Go roll, have fun, and ride safe.